Here we go. Here is a question. Um, are there any known glitches with CPS and firmware version uh, 1.26? Um, that's a good question. Let me see what I'm on here real quick. I know there was a version that came out that was a little bit uh, finicky, which we, we have not recommended yet. Let me take a look. Um, I know this radio is on a, a good stable version. Let's see, And if we put it up on the website as recommended, it's good to go. Uh, it's tested by us. If, if we don't or if we take it down, uh, then there's probably a reason we don't have it up there. Device info. So I am on 2.04. Uh, for firmware here. Let me take a look. 2.26. See if we have that one up here. Yeah, 2.04 for the 878 uh, is currently what we would recommend as the current version. There might be a newer one out there. 1.26, I think, might be the firmware version. Um, you know, that's up to you. We've run into some some weird things with. I think it was that one. Uh, so definitely, I would recommend sticking to the the most recent one that offered on the Bridgecom support page uh, because that's usually tested. Uh, we actually have a, an in-house tech who's brilliant at testing all this stuff. So we test everything and find out, oh, there's actually a lot of bugs in this. So we're not going to put it up yet until they get fixed uh, so to try to stop you guys from running into those problems. So uh, definitely, you know, just, just go based on the Bridgecom page which firmware to go to. But great question. That's awesome.